Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So at the end of March this year, I posted a video that Mozilla had announced that Firefox will support Windows 7 and Windows 8.1 for at least another year. Now, just a quick recap, as I did mention in that video, which I'll leave a link to in the description, um, they had announced that they will not be ending support for Windows 7 and Windows 8 before the release of Firefox 115 ESR. So Firefox 115 ESR will support Windows 7 and Windows 8 at least until the third quarter of next year in 2024. Now that was back uh, in March of this year. And just to let you know, um, if you are still using Windows 7 and Windows 8 and are running Firefox, that now um, Mozilla has given us an actual date and has con now confirmed the end of support date of Firefox for the Microsoft Windows 7, 8 and 8.1 operating systems. Now, um, the date now they have given uh, is September 2024. So before they just said the third quarter of 2024, and now they have given an actual time and date. September 2024 is when Firefox will um, reach its end of life and end of support on those Windows versions. Now currently, if we head to about Firefox, um, we are running version 113, which is the latest stable release, as many of you may know. And Mozilla has announced that Firefox version 115 will be the last supported Firefox version for users of Windows 7, Windows 8, and Windows 8.1. So they say that if you are using these versions of Windows, you will be moved to the Firefox Extended Support Release ESR channel by an application update, and they will provide security updates for you until September of 2024, as mentioned. So September 2024, that's when Firefox will reach its end of life and end of support on Windows 7, Windows 8, and Windows 8.1. And after September of 2024, no security updates will be provided after that date. So just take note of that. Now, um, this does mean, um, as I've posted previously, that um, Firefox now is the only browser, major web browser, that um, carries support now and will continue to support um, Windows 7 and Windows 8. Um, other browsers like uh, Chrome, Brave, Edge, and Vivaldi have all um, ended support already for those versions of Windows. And those are all Chromium-based web browsers. And as many of you will know, Firefox uh, is the only browser that is not based on the open source Chromium platform when it comes to those uh, major web browsers as mentioned. Now, um, just to put this all into context, if we head over to the Firefox release calendar. Okay, this is a release calendar for up and coming releases of Firefox, as we can see. Now, um, Mozilla say they plan to migrate Firefox stable users um, who are using Windows 7, Windows 8, and Windows 8.1 to the Firefox ESR channel when Firefox 115 is released. Now, Firefox 115, version 115, is released and will be released on the 4th of July this year, um, 2023, as we can see. So, 4th of July, that's when Firefox 115 has been released. So what this means in a nutshell is that Firefox users on um, Windows 7 and Windows 8 won't receive any new features uh, to their browsers um, after the release of Firefox version 115. So when Firefox 115 rolls out on the 4th of July, you will not be getting any new features. And um, that means that you'll be bumped over then to Firefox 115 ESR, as mentioned, and Firefox 115 ESR will then continue to get bug fix and security updates moving down into uh, September of 2024, which now is the end of support date, as mentioned, for the Firefox web browser. If you are still using the browser on Windows 7, Windows 8, and Windows 8.1. So I hope this, this just puts everything into context and perspective, as there has been a bit of guessing and estimations and guesstimations going on. And that exact date now has been given, um, as Firefox says, um, that is September of 2024. And um, they say that if you want to keep your Firefox web browser up to date, obviously, um, you'll need to upgrade your operating system to Windows 10 or higher. And most Windows 7 and Windows 8 machines, I think, would be able to support Windows 10. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.